Hello everybody, this is Abdul Wali, the instructor of this course. In this introduction video, I will be giving you a presentation about what we are going to learn and what tools we should have installed before starting this course. So here is the presentation. PHP in MySQL, creating a custom search engine from absolutely scratch. What you are going to learn in this course? You are going to learn uh, creating a search engine in PHP in MySQL from scratch fetching data from the mysql database inserting site details into database and displaying back to the users creating search result driven dynamic pages uploading and displaying images in the search result pages so these all things you will learn during this course next what tools you need to have installed before starting this course you will just need to have three uh, basic tools installed in order to run PHP course on a web server you will need a web browser I will use Chrome you can use Chrome or Firefox or any other browser you like a text editor will be required I will use Notepad++ you can use Dreamweaver, Notepad++ or simple Notepad whatever you like you can use a local or online server will also be required for this course I will use ZAMP for local host because uh, after installing ZAMP we can have three technologies uh, at once like PHP latest version, uh, web server Apache and MySQL database. You can up download these three tools from the internet freely and after that you can install them in your local computer so you will be able to run PHP course on your local computer and your local computer will become a local host, a local server. Next, what you should already know. If you have a basic understanding of HTML, a basic understanding of CSS, and a basic understanding of PHP, then it will be a great advantage for you to learn this course more easily. But if you don't have any of these, uh, any in, any understanding of these languages, then you you don't have to be worried about anything because this course is for absolutely beginners and intermediate users. Next, the components of this course. Here are some components uh, of this course which we will create or which we will be dealing with in the, during this course. An insert page called insert underscore site dot php by using which we will be inserting the website's details and the web pages details into our database and after that we will create a page, a display page called search dot html which will be uh, displaying on the browser to the users where users will be able to search a query or enter a keyword and after that when they will click the search now button they will be coming to this page a result page called results.php where we will display them the relevant result to their query and the results will be coming from our database and also we will need a database called search we will create that inside mysql a, a table will be created called sites inside this search database and we will also need a root folder for this project called search engine that we will create inside htdocs and also we will be having an images folder inside the main folder search engine so these are all the components of this course we will be creating these pages in the folders while learning this course I have installed all these three tools which are required for this course to start with like web browser as a Google Chrome you can use any other Zem, which is the combination of PHP latest version Apache web server and MySQL database we will have these three tools together uh, after installing this Zem and a notepad as a text reader after you download this software from the internet Zem if you visit your computer and the local drive C you will find a folder called ZAMP or there this folder is created by this software after we install this software this folder is automatically created <coughs> and inside this folder we can see a folder htdocs inside which we can save all of our folders and files uh, PHP files which will be run on the user browser so inside this HTDocs folder we will create a folder 
called search engine and inside that folder we will create uh, we will save all the files and the inner folders to uh, run this project and to complete this project so you can download these three softwares from, from the internet freely just by writing their names and, and finally this course uh, will be containing on three sections or more than three sections but at least on three sections so uh, from the first video after this uh, introduction and presentation we will start working on it and at first stages we will create its folders inner folders and the display page as well as the inserting page these all things will be covering in the first section and after that we'll go further in this course so stay tuned